linger? Do you have to? Do you have to? Do you have to let it linger? Well, Fred! You did that song, Glycerine. The Bush. No. I thought they were saying Listerine. My parents have been bugging me for the longest time. I just couldn't take it anymore. So, I remember this book that I read a couple years ago. This girl put arsenic on the powdered donuts and she gave them to her parents and they died and I thought I could do that. So, so I did. I feel really bad about it, but I couldn't couldn't stand living with them anymore. I was going nuts, <laughs> totally nuts. I just I just couldn't take it. I just couldn't take it. They'll never know. No one will ever know. I pretended I was sad. Of course I really wasn't, but they never knew the difference. They took me to my grandparents' house. They were crying. And I felt kind of bad about it, but happy in another way. You know, because I was finally rid of those people that constantly nag me every day and kind of relieved, you know, to be rid of them. Never have to look at their faces. Never have to look at their faces again. Well, anyway. I went back to my house a few days later to get some clothes and stuff, and a cop came to the door. I think he suspected me, you know, because he started asking me all these questions about what they ate that morning, and he said the autopsy revealed that they had died of arsenic poisoning. And I kind of got nervous. And 